Yeah, we were making our way back to the Swamp Witch's Swamp. Something is moving, what is that? My heart is racing right now. Guys, something just like whispered in my ear. Steven. Hi, Steven. Hi. This was fully charged. And it's already down to two. That shouldn't happen. This was fully Stop recording. The worst headache right here. Feels like there's many spirits here. 45. 45 spirits? I feel that cold breeze coming towards me again. Oh. Urban legend tells of a swamp haunted by the angry spirit of a woman who in the 1700s was killed for practicing witchcraft. It's said she now remains here to get her revenge on all who enter. The first investigation into this swamp legend revealed more than the feared Hog Island witch haunts this area. A great amount of paranormal evidence and activity was captured. Evidence that suggests several spirits including women and children, possible demons, and even the mention of an elemental, a being that has been here before humans, still lurk in the darkness. For the second investigation, I wanted to start off in the daytime before coming back later that night to what would end up being the scariest night of my life. So yeah, I wanted to see what kind of responses we get during the day here, see if they line up with anything we got at night. While walking around, one specific area kept drawing my attention. I decided to pull out the ovulus, a device that uses shifts in the electromagnetic field to produce words, to see if I could get any responses. The graves. The graves? Is there a cemetery nearby? Or is somebody buried out here? Me. Who upset you? When we were here the first time, I got the response aggravated. Agitated. I don't know if it really picks up well on camera, but this cypress tree is ancient you can tell just by how different the bottom looks as opposed i mean this here is a pretty good size one that's a pretty good size one and that thing is three times the size of them that's been here for a long time and there's another one that's back right there that one's pretty old too My name is Jay. I don't. Quiet. Okay. I was just trying to introduce myself and be respectful and nice. Can you tell me your Our name? Our settlement. Is your settlement here? Figure. Figure? I don't know if this camera is probably, I think it's pointed this far over, but 
The reason I keep looking over here is because I swear I saw something move in between two trees but not go any past any, so I don't know if something fell. Could have just been a branch falling out of a tree. I don't know, but that's why I keep looking back over this way. Acknowledge. You want me to acknowledge you? Sounds like something's walking around over there. Is that you? War. War? We got that response here last time, too. Are you agitated that I'm here, Philip? Is this Philip? My head. Were you, were you wounded in battle in your head? While I can definitely hear an EVP here, it is not clear to me if it is go or no. What are your thoughts? On your head? On your head? Something really weird that I noticed over here. I'm gonna grab the camera and show you. I've been walking around out here for an hour, hour and a half now. And I haven't seen any other rocks out here. But this is 100% rock. And this, rock rock I think that's rock right there too and right there so we got the response our settlement this could have been like foundation material for a house that used to be right here or they could be we also got the graves when I was walking right in here they could be old grave markers they just put a rock there, I don't know. I don't think they have any writing on them. It's but... not just me here. Okay, who else is here? Yeah, that's another rock right there. And like I said, I've walked around here and I just see fallen trees and dirt. Those are the first group of rocks and the way that they're set right here, it almost looks like a house could have sat right here back in the day. I mean, like, yeah. Was your house right here? Is that what you meant by our settlement? Mildred. Hi, Mildred. Thank you for telling me your name. When I was here last time, you said there's an elemental here? Yes? Can you tell me what that is? Dangerous? You, you said not to feed it. What do you feed one of those anyway? Blood? Is it something that I can physically see or is it invisible? Don't worry. Uh, 
as long as I don't give it blood, it'll I'll be fine. Right? I swear that just sounded like somebody was walking up here. Who's just walking up here? How many, how many of you are there out here with me? Ten? Are you a family? No. No? Just stuck here? Is there more than one elemental? There's six? Can you tell me... Can you tell me anything about the witch? Leave? Was she a good person? Was she a bad person? Yes? Did she really kill people? Yep. Does she still come after people? What does my shirt say right here? Demon Dilla? I, I think I'm pretty sure I heard that. Is there a skunk ape out here? Yes. Is that who makes those tree knocking noises? Is he who, is he who broke that tree behind me? Did you say the Bigfoot is an elemental? Yeah? Yeah? Is that why it's so hard to see one and find one? Is because they're an elemental? That's interesting. Thank you for telling me that. That is very interesting to me that it said that a Bigfoot is an elemental. I'm pretty sure that's what I heard. I don't know if I've ever heard anybody say something like that. But then I look behind me and I see this. I don't know, there's mud here. I don't see. I mean, that kind of looks like a footprint. It's not mine, but I don't think that's a Bigfoot footprint. These look like deer hoof prints. Yeah, it looks like normal deer footprints and stuff to me. All right, so that was very interesting. A lot of really good responses, I feel like, especially the fact that I could understand them at the time. But um, I feel a lot more comfortable about coming out here later on tonight. And uh, obviously, I'll be in a little bit warmer of clothing. But uh, I will see you once the sun goes down, my friends.
I went through the exact same thing this time around. It's actually, it's like a hundred times worse for me right now than it was the first time I came out here. But um, yes, I look a little different than I did this afternoon when I was out here. I uh, cleaned up my uh, beard and mustache and stuff a little bit. And then I also tried to cut my hair, but that turned into a disaster. So I'm not going to show you that. Unless it gets too hot and I have to take my hat off. But, um, yeah, we were making our way back to the Swamp Witch's Swamp. And uh, I went through the same thing again this time with the three hours of talking myself into coming here. I sat in my car over here for probably a good 30 minutes, 45 minutes, like freaking out at every little noise that I heard. It's taken me probably 15 minutes to go. There's my car. I don't know if it's... Is it going to show up? Yeah. There's my car right there. So, it... It took me almost like 15 minutes to go. Maybe 200 yards. <laughs> and I still don't know if I'm going to make it back there or not. It is so freaking creepy out here tonight. Um... It was very interesting this afternoon though, some of the responses we got. I'm looking forward to running Ghost Tube tonight, maybe doing another necrophonic session, seeing what else we can capture, if I can make it out there. You guys as always, let me know if you see or hear anything that I miss in the comments. Um, I really appreciate all of you that give me those captures. I know not everyone will hear what I hear or what you hear, but uh, it's really cool pointing all that stuff out and a lot of times it has something to do with what's going on so My heart is racing right now. I have no idea why. But as soon as I walked in here, like it's 63 tonight, it felt like it was in the 30s in here and my heart is racing right now. I can't tell if that's... Man, I keep hearing creepy noises behind me. I can't tell if this is an old... Just an old tree that fell. It looks like it's too perfectly shaped. Like it was... Like a timber or something. I don't know. Maybe it is just an old tree that fell. It's just when you look through here... That really stands out. It looks like a little concrete wall, but it, it is wood. Did you used to live out here? Feeling that ice cold breeze again. 
and it's honestly like I said before it's 63 tonight but it's not supposed to get I think 59 I think is the low tonight or actually no it's like 61 this is a location though right in here where I think there was an old homestead um, simply because there's two very large oak trees in a big open area right here it seems very plausible that either a business like a sawmill or something was here or a home was here at one point What is that? What the freak did I just see? It almost looked like some weird human thing standing there and it moved as soon as, oh my God. While whatever I saw was not captured on film, I can best describe it as a five foot tall, pale, human-like figure with no hair, no clothes, and black eyes. Hello? Okay, I'm hearing walking over there, and I swear I just heard a voice. I don't know. There might be just a demon dilla over there. Um, that might be all it is. Could be a deer. Hopefully a wild hog doesn't come running out at me. But I swear I heard a voice that came from like right here, right next to me. If you were talking to me, can you say that again? That light's probably too bright. I told you it was colder in here than it is anywhere out there. Over by my car, you would not see my breath. It is so cold right here. This is a weird little lake. alter things set here or something, I don't know. <sighs> 
since I'm already hearing stuff here, which is about the same place that I got stopped last time I walked through here, I'm going to go ahead and turn ghost tube on. We'll see what responses we get. Listen. Leave it. Leave what? I heard the owl. Is that what you wanted me to? What do you want me to leave? You want me to leave the swamp? You want me to leave this area where you... Did you used to have a house here? Listen, leave it. I don't know if they meant the altar thing or if they meant like leave the swamp. Let's keep pushing. How does it work? You uh, just say things and this should let me know if hopefully this says what you're trying to tell me. You just have to talk. Are you, you were asking, hand. hand, this device in my hand, yeah, it just allows me to understand you, or did you mean my camera? How old are you? I'm in my 40s. How old are you? What the freak? What the freak? Guys, something just like whispered in my ear. Like right here. And I heard footsteps come up here and there's no animals. And I have chills. You really see my breath right now. Will you tell me your name? My name is Jay. That was freaky. I heard like footsteps come right up to me here. And then it felt like somebody like was standing next to me and just kind of in my ear. Will you tell me your name? Or how old you are? Am I in danger? Is that why you're trying to distract me from going forward? Is this Philip? Is 
Stephen. Hi, Stephen. Hi. Yeah, there you are. It's okay. None of my devices will hurt you, Stephen. You can even come closer to it if you want. It just makes the lights go higher, if like yellow, orange, red, if you get closer. How does it work? Because of your energy. It picks up your energy. Kind of like my legs do when you stand next to me and I can feel the ghost goosebumps. Is that you walking over there in the woods, Philip? Steven? Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm being surrounded. Hello? Steven? Are you the one walking in the woods? Why did you come? I came to visit with the people up ahead. But I could sense that you seemed like you wanted to weak. talk. Weak? Are you weak right now? Is that why you could only light it up to the one green light? Because you're weak right now? How do I use it? What do you want to use? Are you taking power away from my flashlight? Look at this. Let me turn this down. This was fully charged. And it's already down to two. That shouldn't happen. This was fully... Stop recording. Uh-oh. Why do you want me to stop recording? Are you getting camera shy? Is that what you've been trying to ask me how to use so you could stop it? Here, Stephen, I'll make a deal with you. I'll set it down on this tree stump here. Okay? And then you can come over by it without me near it. If I can get it to stay without flipping over. Follow me. Follow you. Just a minute. Curse. Curse? What do you mean curse? Is there a curse out here? Is that why y'all are stuck? Because of a curse? Steven, I can definitely feel you next to me. Like, I'm getting goosebumps like crazy. Look, you were asking how this works. This square button right here, if you push that square button, it'll stop recording. I'll go stand over here. If you really want me to stop recording and follow you, can you push stop on the... If you really want me to stop recording and follow you, can you push stop on the, it's the little square button on the screen there, on that little black device. Six. Steven, you're six? Did you push stop? Oh, you could have pushed stop. I wouldn't have been mad. Are you six, really, Steven?
Or is there six of you here? If I'm being honest right now, I don't know if it's just because I'm so paranoid and I'm looking every which way, hearing every little sound or what, but I have the worst headache right here. It's like right from the side of my eye going up in my temple right there. What? I could swear I just heard a whisper. Right in my left ear. Brother. Your brother? Who's your brother? Was that your brother that whispered to me? Rancher. You were a rancher? Was this your settlement? Somebody earlier said this was their settlement. Are you related? Danger. Danger? I swear I got that before I went in here. I think I also got haunt were haunted last time I walked up to the swamp before too. Yeah, it's right about here. It just all of a sudden got to like, I don't know if I'm going forward now. My heart is beating out of my chest. I'm short of breath. It feels like Antarctica on that side. Wow, it is so cold back here. And it was like 86 today, so there's no way like cold air got trapped in here or anything like that. Frogs are a lot more alive tonight. Liar. Liar? What? Who's a liar? Psychic. I'm not psychic. Am I? Are you saying that because I was asking for you, Philip? Spirit. 
feels like there's many spirits here. 45. 45 spirits? It definitely feels like it's crowded. Like in between every one of these trees, there's a pair of ghost eyes looking at me. Danger. Graveyard. Dang. Graveyard. The graves. The graves? Is there a, like a mass burial here that nobody knows about? Hidden. It's hidden? Demon child. What? That's, I got that response out here as well, but it was in a different video out in that parking lot. Did they hide it because there's a demon child in it? Look, there's one of those situations. There's a leaf moving right there. And nothing else is moving. There's no wind at all tonight. Look how still everything else is. Even all those dead leaves right there aren't moving. Over here. Whoa, something just fell over there. Over where? Right or left? Ice cold breeze just came from this way. Holy smokes. Happy. Are you happy to see me? I told you I would come back. That is so weird that that just keeps going. I mean, if there was wind, the weeds would be moving. I just want to meet her. I don't, I don't mean her any... Look at that leaf up there just moving on its own and nothing else is moving. I'll get all the leaves that I can in the picture and you see this one here is the only one moving. I've heard that about this area so much that one thing will be moving when nothing else is. Mary. Disagree. You disagreed with... Demon child. Demon child? Again? Really? I'm trying to get comfortable out here. Why do you keep trying to scare me? What is your name? My name is Jay. I came to talk to Mildred. Or Philip. Are they here? Can you tell me your name? Other than Demon Child? I'm close. You're close? I can feel you. Did you know that you affect temperature? Find, me. Find you? I would say that you're over here somewhere. Is that right? The cold melt? melt? I would say freeze. It gets colder the closer I get to you, it feels like. Is this the demon child trying to play games with me? Get me lost in the woods? Because it is ice cold right here. Holy crap. 
Oh my god, dude. I have goosebumps. False. False. What year is it? Who's talking to me? I mean, I know there's frogs, but I keep hearing somebody saying stuff. Today is the last day of uh, January, 31st, 2023. Oh my God, dude. Twenty-six. Twenty-six. You think it's nineteen twenty-six? Is that when you passed away? Was that the last year? Leaving? I'm not leaving. I just came over here for a second. I honestly don't know what to think right now. I don't know if they're calling me a demon child because I'm out here ghost hunting and they don't understand it and they think that similar to how witches were misconstrued as evil things that maybe they think that I'm the demon child. But to get that twice tonight and then in the parking lot where you park to come out here, we got that as well. And then I keep hearing like voices around me. It almost feels like people are just walking by saying stuff. Um, it would be very interesting to listen to this back. The ground just moved right there. I'm positive the camera did not pick it up, but the ground just moved like somebody stepped down and moved. I saw a stick and a leaf both pop up. Maybe, I don't think, I think I've been sitting here long enough that if I had done that, it would have already popped up by now. That was very strange. I wish I could have caught that. Did you just walk by me? Would you be able to knock on a tree and let me know you're here? All right, my friends. I'm gonna do uh, another necrophonic session. If Philip or Mildred's around, will you please come talk to me? Do we have to? You don't have to. I would just like, I just feel like I know you guys, so I wanted to communicate with you. Are there 46 spirits here?
Are there 46 of you here with me? Yeah? Were you referring to me as the demon child? Peter? What did Peter do to become a demon child? Does time not exist on your side? No? Can you tell me, was the witch that supposedly lived out here good? She helped you? She was a healer? Is that why she's so upset in the afterlife? Because she was a healer and they took it wrong? Would you be able to tell me her name yet? Did you say Jerry? You, is that your name or are you trying to say my name? I keep feeling like something's biting me underneath my clothes. And I have like my shirts tucked in so I don't know how it would get in there. Earlier today, when I was out here, you said something about there being six, six elementals. Have they been here since the beginning of time? Are there any anywhere near me? Two? Just about, yeah? Are they mad that I'm here? I feel that cold breeze coming towards me again. Oh! Oh! See? I knew it. I knew it. As soon as I said I felt that cold breeze. Holy crap. So glad I brought a second lamp, a second battery. Were you taking, the, you took energy from my light? I guess I did tell you you could do that. I just didn't expect it. Yeah, I should have a whole nother hour on that battery and it's completely dead. Oh, God. Thank goodness for having two flashlights with me. Are you trying to scare me out of here? Yes? I can't wait to hear more about what they said about the demon child stuff because I think they said that there's a demon child named Peter here. Um, but to get that cold breeze coming over, like right from my camera this way and then all of a sudden the camera light dies. And like I said, there should be a whole nother hour on there. Plus I've already showed you guys this is drained down to two. It hasn't drained anymore, it doesn't look like, but they must have been taking the power from that or something. But, uh, 
it definitely feels like it's time to go. That's all I know. I've been here for a couple of hours now, walking around, doing a few spirit box sessions. Look, I just saw a light over there. What the hell? There shouldn't be any lights. Hello? I'm literally, I'm literally like four miles back in the woods. Um, it's about a mile and a half hike or so back here and about three miles or so worth of a drive back into the woods just to get to the parking lot to walk back here. So there shouldn't be any other lights out here unless somebody's coming out here to ghost hunt or something else. Yes, I get it, I'm leaving. I swear something just said get. All right, my friends, we're gonna head back. Don't forget to smash that thumbs up on the way out. Um, I know with YouTube's new notifications, I know with YouTube's one of their newest updates or something it reset everybody's notifications so make sure even if you are subscribed already make sure to hit that notification bell the little bell next to it click on it and make sure you're on all because a lot of you are saying you're not getting notified and i think it might be because that update happened and uh it reset everybody's settings to personalized which means you don't get any so uh, go ahead and do that. Coming up on the end screen, you can click up here to watch the last time I was here and cross-reference the evidence that we found, as well as down here to watch a playlist. And as always, don't forget to check out the journeyisadestination.shop for all your journey merch. Whole bunch of new designs on there as we speak, as well as coming out soon. And we will see you on the next Explorer, my friends. Much love.